Hi, Time Masters. It is Friday afternoon, which for me is usually a really creative time. It's such a weird thing, but I'm often my most creative on Friday afternoons. Here I am asking you guys to think about decluttering as we're going into a weekend. I'm not asking you to do anything yet, but I want you to start saying out loud what it is you would love to declutter. Hi, Catherine. The power of saying something out loud is incredible. And I want you to start noticing how things shift for you when you state them, when you give them voice. <clears throat> Excuse me. An example that I have is probably about four years ago, three years ago, I was in the middle of the lowest point in my first business. I knew in a meeting that I needed to leave, that I, that I couldn't be at that business anymore, that the paradigm had shifted, that the goals had shifted, that the vision had shifted. And I was feeling kind of burned out. It was June. I will never I will never forget sitting outside with my best friend, who was also one of my partners, and saying to her, I can't do this anymore. Can I just say, I adore the bookshelf behind you. Thanks, Catherine. I had a designer do it because I can't do that shit. So thank you. So I remember saying to my, my best friend and my partner, I can't do this anymore. This is shifted too much. It's no good anymore. And the power of saying that out loud started some very teeny tiny movements forward. And I would probably have, it, my, it took me six months, hi Jamie, to get out of that business. And that's a different story for a different time. But I want you to know if I hadn't said it out loud in a safe space, nothing would have shifted. <clears throat> so I wanted to encourage you this weekend to start thinking about what are the little stones that you're going to start moving away from some big pile of rocks that you have in your house. It might be, and I've, I've watched, I'm watching you guys talk about it in the group. It might be uh, a place where you've thrown everything in a room. It might be a desk. It might be a drawer. It might be a closet. It might be something on your phone. It might be your contacts list. There's something that feels really big and heavy and you haven't addressed it yet. But every time like your eyes kind of glance over it, it's mental clutter. It's heaviness in your brain. Let's give it voice. I want you to just start saying out loud, I'm going to tackle X, or I'm going to tackle this thing. This is the thing I'm going to focus on. It's not going to be done in a day because it didn't get that way in a day. So we're going to kind of peel back the layers and I'm going to tell you it's going to be hard. But I want you to understand that whatever it is you want to change in your life, put voice to it. That's the very first thing because that's awareness. That's like I've been looking at this closet. Every time I open up this pantry, I, my, I mentally go, fuck. And I, I don't do anything about it, but it's weighing on me and I do anything to avoid going into the pantry. It's stuff like that. It's time to give it voice and to give it voice in a safe space. I'm never going to say to you, oh yeah, you've wanted to do that for years. I don't believe you'll never do it. I believe you will do it. It might take you six months, just like it took me six months to declutter myself from that business. It might take you a long time. That's okay. We are making progress. We are not about perfection. So what can you give voice to this weekend? And don't say it in like, I suck that this toy closet, which is actually right here. I suck that this toy closet is filled with Legos that Jack doesn't even play with anymore. Or this is going to take me a year to get through. Or I don't know how. Don't start with those negative things. What I'd love for you to start with is, I don't like the way that looking at this closet makes me feel. I don't like the way that looking at this desktop makes me feel. I don't want to feel this way any longer and I'm going to take an action. That's all I want you to do right now. Give voice to it and feel the power in that. So if you will drop me a note about what you're giving voice to and if you have trouble giving the voice to it, let me know. I will help you reframe it. But I love the conversation that's already started happening and I can't wait to see what we choose to declutter this, this upcoming week and where we're going after that. This, this week, uh, the, starting the 7th, is gonna be all about digital decluttering. So put voice to that. And if you don't want to do digital decluttering and you want to do a closet, that's fine with me. You're still welcome in the group, but just put voice to it. Thank you for watching. Catherine, I'm so honored that you like this thing behind me because uh, one of my big worries is how is my visual clutter going on in my house when people are looking at me speak. So thank you. Thank you so much for that. I'll talk to you guys soon. Bye.